Hello, hello. Today we're going to do one of my favorite breathing exercises. This exercise is called the diaphragm stretch. And it's a great one to do before you go into meditation or before you go into any other type of, of breathing exercises. It's also good before sleep. Um, it's gonna work our diaphragm. Just like in the name of diaphragm stretch, we're actually going to stretch this muscle, this powerhouse of a muscle that lives right around the center of the body, okay? I like to think of the diaphragm like a jellyfish. Sometimes we can use all kinds of images for the diaphragm. An umbrella opens and closes. A pump, right, that it's kind of pumps fluid through our bodies. Um, one of the most important muscles in the body would be the diaphragm, in my opinion. Um, if you have tightness in your neck and shoulders, working the diaphragm can give you a lot of relief in that area. Um, also, if you have tension and tightness in your back, working your diaphragm can also give you a lot of relief in your low back. So we're going to do version one today, and later I will add uh, version two. Some of you do this with me a lot, so if it's new to you, just take your time. Whenever we learn something new, let's, let's just try to stay as relaxed as possible in that learning process. Um, and, and we'll do it together. So I'm gonna talk you through it and then I'm gonna show you. What's gonna happen is we'll lay on our backs, we'll bring our arms overhead, we'll inhale through the nose and then we'll open the mouth and we're gonna to exhale today for 10 counts. And we're gonna to try to force out all the breath from the body in 10 counts. At the bottom of that exhale, we'll hold the breath out and then we're gonna bring our hands onto the body and then we'll just relax everything, okay? We're just gonna do three, all right? And you can do up to three to five of these. Um, Practice daily, practice often, okay? So we're gonna lay on our backs and we're gonna bring the back flush to the mat, okay? So bringing the back, so I'm gonna draw my pelvis under me, bringing the back flush to the floor. I'm gonna take my hands in a W shape. Now for you, you might want, if your hands, if your shoulders are okay with it, you can take your arms overhead. Mine are a little tight, so I'm gonna keep my elbows bent. And then I'm gonna make sure my ribs are down into the mat, okay? My back is flush. Feet a little wide and I could drop, drop my knees in if that feels comfortable. We're gonna inhale through the whole body. So inhale into your ribs, into your lungs. You're gonna open the mouth and we're gonna do this first one together. We're gonna open the mouth and exhale for 10 counts. Close the mouth, hold the breath out. Bring your hands on your body, and then relax everything. And you'll just feel that breath come rushing in. Let's just let the body breathe, about two recovery breaths, about two nice, easy breaths. Just relax, nowhere to go. Nothing to do but breathe. And then let's do another one. Drawing the pelvis under you, back is flush to the mat, arms in your W. You're taking an inhale into the side, front and back of your ribs. Open the mouth, open that jaw. Let's exhale for 10. Empty out, all the way out. Close the mouth, hold the breath out. Bring your hands on your body. Relax everything, let the pelvis relax. Let that breath come rushing in. Let that new oxygen come in, that new space. Let's go one more, drawing the back, flush to the mat. Neck is long, ribs against the floor. Easy body, inhale. Open that mouth, I'm gonna count you this time. Exhale for 10, nine, eight, seven, Six, five, four, three, two, one, all the way out. Hold the breath out. Bring the hands onto the body and then completely relax and let the body breathe. Take a moment just to allow the body to breathe. And then just take your time, roll to either side, and just come up to the seat or wherever you are. Take your time to come to standing. 
and thank you so much. Let me know how it goes if you have any questions and um, practice this day.